question for the Minister of Labour. It's not like Steve Mahoney has been getting things done at the Workplace Safety Insurance Board. The Canadian Federation of Independent Businesses has raised the alarm alerting the McGuinty Liberals of the, quote, gross mismanagement of the WSIB. The WSIB's unfunded liability has tripled to over $11 billion in four years. What a mess. Even though the McGuinty government said it would eliminate the un unfunded liability by 2014, the McGuinty Liberals simply have no credibility when it comes to economic management. Why did you promise to fix the problem, Minister, and then make things worse? Yeah. Sir. Thank you very much, uh, Mr. Speaker. Mr. Speaker, the member would be well aware that the WSIB, as, as well as other large organizations with large capital pools, have been hit by the downturn in the economy. We've had some great years and great prosperity, Mr. Speaker. For 10 to 15 years, the WSIB was making great progress as the economy grew with their fund. The downturn in the unfunded liability is completely attributed to the downturn in the markets, Mr. Speaker. We have looked at other compensation boards across the country, and, Mr. Speaker, the unfunded li their, their liabilities have also, and their assets have also been hit by the recession. Speaker, I've spoken to the chair and to the board of the WSIB, and they've advised, uh, advised me that the current financial position has weakened and the global via via tilt. Thank you. Supplementary. Again, for the Minister, a pattern is developing where the McGuinty Liberals will say anything to avoid fixing the problem. Even before the global recession, the WSIB's plan for a 9% return on investment was irresponsible. Yes. Were they planning on banking with Bernie Madoff? Now, with the global recession, we can't know if they've learned their lesson. Why? Because the WSIB hasn't filed an annual report for 08 and 09. But what we do know is that the McGuinty Liberals... Just uh, ask the Minister of Finance. I'm having difficulty hearing the question and sitting just to my left. Just trying to cover we it do up. know that the McGuinty Liberals' new plan to stop the bleeding at the WSIB is for premium hikes and making small businesses pay for secretaries and office staff who will never collect benefits. It's a Ponzi scheme. Only the people being added to the pyramid go in knowing that they're being cheated. Why did the McGuinty Liberals create a scheme where everyone pays for something that doesn't work? Here, here. Here. Mr. Speaker, the member is completely wrong. Dead wrong. Dead wrong. Dead when wrong. it comes to government side, I would. Uh, you have your own member who is up speaking. Stop the clock, please. Uh, your own member who is trying to answer a question, and you're shouting him down, and it's making it extremely difficult for you, for me to hear the minister speak. Minister. Again, uh, Mr. Speaker, the member is uh, completely wrong. When, Mr. S Mr. Speaker, we look at premium rates at the WSIB, premium rates have not changed in the last number of years. We have held the line on premium rates again this year. We understand, we understand Mr. Speaker, that there is a balance between how uh, we set premium rates for employers and the impact of employers, as well as the good work that those premium rates do to help our injured workers. And that's what the WSIB is meant to do, is be an insurance for those injured workers, a no-fault insurance that provides the ability for employers to do their business in Ontario, Mr. Speaker. Thank you. Final supplementary. Good. Good. Well, I think the pattern is clear. It's called rot. With e-health, the Premier has senior ministers deciding who to hand untendered contracts to, and they end up spending billions of dollars while we're no closer to having electronic health records. At OLG, the Premier and his ministers are so preoccupied with PR around these expenses that the McGuinty Liberals have no credible plan to prevent insider wins. With Mahoney, the Premier and his minister are so busy looking after their Liberal friend they look the other way when he expenses his entitlements. And they have no credible plan to deal with the unfunded liability at the WSIB. Why doesn't the McGuinty government understand that it's not just the money they're wasting, it's that Premier McGuinty and his ministers just aren't doing their jobs?
Speaker, the, the, the member uh, maybe doesn't realize that what the WSIB is there for is to ensure our workers, if they get injured, are, are cared for, Mr. Speaker. And that's what those premium rates are, are, go to. Now, Mr. Speaker, the, the member and, uh, and uh, some of uh, the other uh, par Conservative Party members bring in the question expenses and other things that are happening at the uh, WSIB. I know the member had the opportunity to have a lunch or a, uh, an outing with the chair of the WSIB. That's right. And That's my right. understanding is the only... There was uh, some alcohol expensed, and it was expensed as the member had some alcohol with the chair, Oh, and, really? and that, that alcohol oh. was expensive. So I, I don't know what the member is saying. The member should look at his own What's actions when he comes to this house and start. New question.